If an enemy is hiding inside a smoke, just switch to FPP and rush in. It's easier to spot an enemy using FPP compared to TPP. This truck in Novo can be used as a good hiding spot. Just come near it and climb it. You can now prone yourself and wait for your enemies. As soon as you spot one, you can surprise them from behind. If you're in this building and an enemy rushes towards you, just jump from the right window to land directly into the lower window. Now you can surprise your enemy from the back. Let's learn a basic fact. If you press the drive button and exit, you'll land on your left side. Similarly, if you press the get in button and exit, you'll land on your right side. In intense situations like this, we'll quickly press the get in button and exit to confuse our enemy. If you're in Novo, you can climb over this cylinder and jump over to the roof. Now go here and get onto the tree in this manner. You can knock your enemies easily from this spot. If you're near this building in the military base, climb over this box. Now go a bit backwards and climb over here in this manner. This is a very good spot to hide yourself when you're the only one left in your squad. If you're inside this triple story building and an enemy rushes towards you, go to the top floor and jump onto this window. Nobody can spot you from the stairs, so you can take an easy knock. If you're on the terrace of a triple story building, just jump onto this railing and climb this fence. Now go back a bit and jump towards the roof in this manner. You can get a very good view from the top and spot the enemies easily. If you're swimming underwater, you won't lose your health until 17 seconds have passed. After that, you'll start losing 5 HP every 2 seconds. Hence, if your health is full, you can survive for 40 more seconds. So in total, you can survive for approximately 57 seconds under the water. If an enemy is camping above you, firstly, get to know his exact position using TPP. It may seem to you that you're undercover, but the enemy may be able to see your head. So just switch to FPP. So if you're able to see the enemy, even the enemy would be able to see you now. So just be quick and take an easy knock. If you spot an enemy on top of this house, stand near the door and jump onto this window. Now grab this small roof and climb into the house in this manner to surprise your enemy. While crossing the bridge, one good way to check the bridge camp is to stop over here and look carefully. Since vehicles get rendered easily, we can spot a vehicle behind the broken bus. Hence, we can confirm that the bridge is camped. You cannot see the vehicle if you scope in. Now, since you already know about the bridge camp, you can take a good fight. Here's a good hiding spot inside Georgia Pole. Just climb onto this crane and jump over to here. Now just hide yourself and take some easy knocks. When you're using a 6x scope, triple tap on the scope button to increase your vision around the sides of the scope. Here's the normal look, and here's the look you get after the triple tap. If you spot an enemy inside this barn house near the Giorgio city, you can climb this wall and jump over to here. Now enter into the building and surprise him.
Keep in mind that a smoke lasts for approximately 40 seconds. You can jump higher by clicking on the jump and crouch button together. Here's a normal jump. Here's the jump using the trick. Ever got knocked while marking your enemy's location on the container? While playing with your squad, it would be good practice to mark each of the Georgia Pole containers with a number, such as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. So the next time you spot an enemy somewhere, just shout the number of that container. Suppose you like a gaming name and the name is already taken by someone else. Here's a trick for you all. For example, let's take a common word such as like. Since this name is already taken, we'll use a trick. You can add in characters such as these in front of the name. Since PUBG doesn't recognize these characters, you'll see a blank space after your name. Now let's check. The same in the lobby and also in the game. Here's a fun trick. Take a smoke, look towards the top, and pull it. After three to four seconds, go to your home screen quickly. Now wait for about five seconds and open the app again. Boom, here's a smoke tower. Here's a bonus tip. Subscribe to Clash Universe for more such videos. Let's keep a like aim of 10,000. Hope you guys do it.